No, no, stick up. When, yeah, my inner leg goes to the outside, his inner leg goes to the outside. So he has a leg, I have a leg. We call this position 50-50. Because I can attack a heel hook, he can attack. Okay, you know what you're gonna do? We're gonna, gonna add the chill that's your life. Yeah, we're gonna do that first. So this is a short one, we're gonna make it a long one. So, please remember, which leg I'm gonna attack? It's a concept in Jiu It's the leg that I'm controlling between my legs. I'm gonna attack. Am, am I gonna attack this leg, the outside, that there is no leg around it, or the one that I'm controlling with? Technically and logically, it has to be this leg. So, he has to cover the heel of that leg. If he's doing the opposite, some people they don't know, wait up. They do this. If you do it like so, even cross the yeah, like this, you're giving me the heel. And I'm breaking them with the heel. So the first one is, boom, amazing. You can hide it ankle to ankle, or you lock a triangle. Yes. Now I can't do this one, but the mistake he's doing, stay where you are. So, if you, put, yeah, if you put your foot there, it's a deadly, Theo talks about it, it's a deadly toehold. Because you're locking yourself, if I grab you here, you can't escape, do you understand? You can't, yeah, wherever you go, I'm breaking it. And I'm crunching, go back. So to solve this problem, if you prefer the triangle, first of all, don't do it until here, this is weak. Just the first triangle, there, yes. And you put the foot behind it. Yes. Now even if I grab, nothing is gonna happen. And I can't reach for a toe hole. So just remember, when you're 50-50, ankle to ankle, or first triangle, but the foot is behind you. So even if you grab me now, yeah, it's hard. I'm behind you. I can, you can do it like so. Yeah, like, like here. I'm not, I'm not turning like so. I'm here. Okay. Now we're gonna talk about how to attack. So I prefer guys ankle to ankle. Okay. To make things simple, we're gonna start ankle to ankle. What you're gonna do, guys? My grips matter. So let's call this one the cross because it's gonna cross our center. Straight cross. We're gonna go with before I'm gonna take my hand, I'm gonna do a false grip, and I'm gonna put my elbow on the floor. Again, close. No, don't straight and then be normal. Yeah. So guys, I'm gonna take my hand, go to the to the shin, and I'm taking my foot against his foot here. The top. The other one is gonna swim between his legs. To the ankle. You notice how I, my butt, when I went here, I um, made space a little bit. When you make space, space in the foot, and I'm hiding my ankle, he's not gonna reach it. What I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna separate them by forcing this action. I grab and I just move back and I pull with my body. When you have it, don't let go of this one, because even if you go, you're gonna use this leg and defend it. Yes. So again, we're just gonna be here. We're just gonna grab, grab the second time. He's the worst cameraman ever. Marcus, come here. You can move, no? So I'm here. So I'm gonna just move my butt to make space to push with your legs. Uh, with your arms, make it sense, right? And now look, you pull it and you take it. Once you take it, don't let go of this hand. Just you scoot your body, look. You're feeding it. Grab the toes and reach. Okay? We're just gonna do the first part, we're not gonna do the deepness. We're gonna give it back again. So you grab, 
If there is no space, move your space. Even your knee enters, doesn't matter. It's better. When you put your knee on the floor, it's amazing. So I grab and I separate. If you're mean, if you're smart, you put your elbow against his toes to just force his foot. When you let go, just feed it and then lean on it. So you see how I'm trapping these toes. Try to pull your toes. And then I don't go on my shoulder, I'm on my elbow. Go now. Okay, three, two, one. It's gonna attack, I'm gonna defend. So I'm here. So Marcus, you just, you're like so, I don't know. He can't escape his knee because the top leg is here. You can't pull it. Try to pull your knee. It's not because this one is grabbing him. Anyhow, so he's gonna attack me first. Boom, he's gonna do that, yeah? The moment he opens this way and he grabs, grab, grab, I'm gonna lift this knee to come near him. The danger part in him is he extends himself. Extend easy, go, extend, extend, extend. No, top. That's the danger part. So come back. It's like an arm bar. Grab, keep it. So when you grab the knee, this is the job. You grab it, when he grabs this one, we grab the knee to come closer to to avoid this knee because if he wants to extend himself he's gonna make this one a buffer between him and me don't extend this knee extend your body but the knee to block me here I, I can't come near him here but if I bypass this knee beforehand before he extends so the moment he starts to extend extend I'm here I'm gonna grab one two Three. Once I do that, I grab the head, I can grab now the elbow. Mr. Cameraman, show the elbow. It's here. I'm grabbing again. So I'm here. I shoot across, we call it like an underhook, or arm drag. One, two. Once I have this one, I'm grabbing his elbow here. Now try to break me, go for real now. He wants to extend himself. Go. I pull it. While I'm extending my leg. Once I do that, I'm gonna hide it again. Once I get there, guess what? I'm gonna immediately attack. Look how I use my leg as I showed you to push my hip and I'm attacking. The moment I grab, he's gonna avoid my knee and punch his arm to my, yeah, then punch it. Now look, I wanna, I wanna break it, but I can't, I swear to God, I wanna break him, look. He's not gonna panic. He knows he's crumbling me. Go, like an arm bar. I'm not extending, now he's grabbing, yes, he's grabbed. That grip, amazing. He's gonna pull. Good job. He's gonna hide himself. Okay, hide it. Ankle to ankle. No, fucked up. Ah, the ankle to ankle. Yes, ankle to ankle. Good. Now you're gonna attack. So the moment you feel, you're gonna let it go. You feel. Ah, you just start. Yeah. While he's busy grabbing my ankle, I'm here. Go, break. I'm, I'm calling if I want with my foot. I'm calling everything to me. I feel nothing. I take it, I want to free my heel. To free your heel, you need a grip above the elbow here. And just pull everything and extend your foot. Once you do that, hide your foot and immediately start attacking. Push and play. Be nice for now, don't resist. Just get the finger, legs, hands, whatever. Okay, three to one. Easy, defendable. How come people are breaking other people's neck? And yeah, you're adding that buffer and you're making it harder for him to catch you. So watch, when you're here, when you go to attack, when you separate, 
you're immediately extending. Once you feed it, you're creeping the top knee also. You see, you're not just here. Even he's grabbing this one, you're creeping this one too. And you're extending yourself. Now, if he wants to grab, grab something, and I'm tight here. Yeah. Now, he can, I, I'm showing him my back actually. I'm looking to the floor. So if he wants to grab, he's gonna grab this hand probably. But it's too late. I'm, I'm, and what I'm doing is, I'm just exploding his knee here. Yeah, this one, again, I'm twisting his foot backwards. So basically the toes are going to his butt. But the real damage is me bridging to his knee. So we're gonna start it here, easy. Look, I creep it this knee. I go on this knee if I want to. And I'm hiding my foot. He can't attack anything here. I'm on one knee here. I'm on my shoulder and one knee. And, and I'm, I'm tight on his head with my feet. Now look what I'm doing. Without my friend, I'm taking his leg here. What I'm doing is, I'm doing this. I'm sending the weight and I'm turning in my place. So again, if you don't see it, what I'm doing, I'm, I'm taking this toes and I'm turning it, turning it, turning it, turning it, at the same time, at the same time I'm putting all the weight on the knee. And this one dislocates the knee. So on last side. So again I'm here. Once I get the access and I jump, even he grabs me here, I'm gonna push off and attack. I, I'm creeping in my knee. And I'm I'm having a, a solid wedge and my legs are closing on his hip. Now I'm looking downward and I'm turning his foot and I'm dropping on his knee. <laughs> okay? Yeah. For now. Yeah. Stop. He's gonna take this leg and lace it. Boom! And he climbs up, 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 and he closes the triangle. Yeah, he can't do ankle to ankle. When it's bottom, it's better like this. Triangle. Ra Ryan Hall style. You see how there is no gap here? That's why, guys, keep your hands and move your head and sneak your hand to grab this top. That, that locks the triangle here. See how it locks the triangle? Mm -hmm. So what I'm gonna go, I'm just gonna move, slide, catch. His mind now. Mm. Judge escape? I will never give him this leg, guys. It's very risky. So from here, I'm gonna do my favorite knee cut thing. So you're just gonna push him. Stay, stay on your back. Okay. I'm grabbing the top leg this time, and we did it in the past just here, so to attack my foot. Because if you don't control this one, he can switch on you, and he attack what we call the bad trap, which is a move here, and then you can't escape, and he can attack your back. So just remember, the top leg, you're pinning it, okay? Now we're gonna escape our legs. We're gonna do it with this way. You straighten your foot, you pull it, and you bring your hand here. Once you do it, you can back. One more time. We do this a lot from Ashi Garami, but just grab the correct 50-50. You can start from Ashi Garami, show them if they don't know 50-50. Attack Ashi Garami. Regular Ashigarami, yes, close, and take your foot, my foot to the other side, yes, yeah, that's a 50-50, okay, so 
So what you're gonna do, you have to move to make space. It should be the opposite because look, this is take here. What? Look. You have to hide this. You have to know which. Again, remember the leg that is between my legs is the one that's gonna be attacked. So, yes, no, here I can. You got me. So I push, I lace it here. And I'm just gonna turn and I push everything with a bump. Bump himself to free your knee. Because here it tucks. And when you go, you're here. Don't continue rolling, guys. Stay really well like this, yeah. Grab the top leg and pin it. So to escape. He can't escape. Extend your foot. Take it to the side. And go. You can let go. Now you're behind. Play with it. Three to one. 